desires are a search for happiness. Let me have a cup of coffee. Why? I'm not feeling quite all right. With a cup of coffee, ah, perfect. <laughs> That's called the desire. I want a house of my own. I want a car of my own. My business must rise up. Why? I am not satisfied. I am searching for happiness. This search for happiness given as a scheme by, the, by your intellect for your satisfaction. These schemes raised by the intellect are called desires. When you have choked with bliss, drowned in bliss, nothing but bliss, after a heavy breakfast on a Sunday, as you are coming out, regretting that I should not have eaten this much, I am sorry, I have overeaten at that time. Tirupadi Prasad, a good ledu. And you know they are very good. And, and you are one who loves sweet. But you are full. You are full to the nostrils. Not to the throat. Just above it. And then you slowly open the eyes, see the ledu. Frijimeraco. <laughs> At two o'clock, three o'clock, maybe I will. Why? At this moment, Paripurna. There is no space for anything. Anything if I put in, all the rest will come out. See? And a man is thus Paripurna in his bliss. See, the ananda, paripurna atma, desiring what? Why should he desire? Because to get a little more happiness from where? Infinite happiness is already there. Kim Karanad, what is the cause for him to have any desire? Deham pushnadi tattvavitra. That one who has reached that state, why should he fatten the body? To fight with others. Swamiji is necessary. But the other is also me. Hi. I don't see the plurality. Even when I see the plurality, I know that it is only my own consciousness fluttering about. So, Kim, what is the cause that I should desire anything? And for what purpose should I fatten the body? Huh? Whatever that comes into it, according to its problem, let him eat. If it has no problem, let him lie down under a tree. And if still no problem, let him die. Why? Because his problem is over, therefore no food will stop. Instead of oiling it and washing it and massaging it and taking exercise and going for a walk in order to digest so that the dinner may still go. Kikiska? For what? Huh? This meant not for sadhak. Sadhaks must eat well and look out to your body. Paramo dharma. Shirira. It's the greatest dharma. Why? With this instrument alone you can reach the highest. But one loving reason, his attitude changes. He doesn't care for the body, whether it lives or falls or returns or, or follows him, it doesn't matter to him. It is not because of his prarabdha it is coming. It is the body's pralabdha, meaning pralabdha of others around it. Mm. 